Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are painting this simple acrylic backgrounds. But before that, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you will get all the notifications. And now let's get started. To see the difference in the backgrounds, I'll be using same colors, blue and pink for all the backgrounds. I am using a filbert brush over here. I have removed the blue color with the help of a cloth and now I am blending both the color. To blend the colors properly, it is very important that both the colors should be little weight. I am using paper here for the video but uh, if you are using canvas, the effect looks amazing. you will see the technique is so simple and the background looks so beautiful. I am using all of these techniques in all of my paintings and here is a reference where I have used this technique for the background. For this background you can use any brush. You can use both the colors randomly here. You can give any strokes and any color in any direction over here. After I am done with both the colors, I am using a mop brush over here and I am slightly touching the surface and it is very important that both the colors should be little weight and I am just slightly moving it on the surface that will mix both the colors and give that soft effect. You can repeat the process till you get the desired background. This is my favorite background and you will see a lot of my paintings in this background. Uh, here is an example of my paintings where I've used this background. For this technique, I won't be using any brush. So first I want to make sure that the color is on all the surface and the white part doesn't show through. Once I am done, I'll be using a sponge. I am taking some color in the sponge and I am dabbing it on the surface. I am using other side of the sponge for the next color so that the color won't get mixed.
you can follow the process till you get the desired background. This is a very simple technique and looks really beautiful and here is an example where I have used this technique for the background and we are done here and I will see you in the next painting. Bye!